Hey tubers, it's Wednesday, what, uh, May 10th, and uh, it's going on 2, and we're about 74 in the garage. <clears throat> and it's a nice day, a little breezy. High's going to be around 78. So, uh, been in the garage, and I have been working on this, and I've been working on uh, the panels. With the nut certs, we've had some issues, as you can see, with this one with the nut certs. So I went ahead and fiberglass cloth the back here. This one I put mat down, and mat seems to be doing the doing the purpose. But uh, but issues are with the nut certs. So I went ahead and I fiberglass cloth both sides because this will be covered up by the by that, and I did the other side too. We had just clamped them together <clears throat> and I drilled the holes through the nut certs to get the holes on the passenger side panel. And I think I'm going to put mat over that. I'm going to cut a little piece of fiberglass mat, just mat over it for the, give the nut certs something more to bite in. So. Now we're going to install this and with the panel and see how it fits. The panel's right there. And see how it fits. So when I get more, I'll turn this back on later. Hey tubers, well there it is. The, remember this will be black and I'll probably spray that black to see how it comes in once I do all the finished body work on it. But we still had some issues. When that top nut cert got out, I slid it. On, the, on this portion of it and uh, didn't get lined back up exactly even though I drilled the hole matched these all this up had these all bolted in when I drilled a new hole into this panel and it still didn't get lined up so there's an issue with this but I can take care of that I really can so but I just needed to see how it's going to fit together and everything else. Uh, learned a lot doing this one. Probably the passenger side is going to come out a lot better. But we'll see. And uh, we're going to get started on that one now next. So when I get more, I'll turn this back on later, guys. All right, real quick, guys. Here we lined up. One of Gary's radiuses that he cut for me, drew a line there to cut it, drew a line there to cut it. The holes that we got from the other panel were drilled through, through the steel panel to mark that. So now we're all lined up. So we'll take this back off, we'll cut this to where it needs to be, and set the metal piece aside. I'm going to take some fiberglass mat and mount it over each one of these and let that set up on both sides and let that set up and then we'll go ahead and uh, and then drill the holes and put the nut certs in. When I get more I'll turn this back on later. Alright tubers I placed a piece of mat here on each of the four bolt holes. Now so I'm going to get ready to do it on the back side so I don't lose my bolt locations. We'll go ahead and drill these holes and then we'll place mat on there and then let this set up overnight and then we'll drill the holes and get ready for the uh, to mount the, uh, the bracket on here. We'll mount this into the car. We will mount the right side bracket on the panel here. Uh, we'll drill the rest of the holes, and then we'll start bending up some more rod. So that's going to be it for today. I want to thank everybody for watching, subscribing, and of course leaving comments. We'll probably pick this up tomorrow. Later, guys. Oh yes, in case you're wondering, yeah, I did clean up in here. I couldn't take it anymore. So, uh, yeah. So, yeah, except for the wind blowing all crap back in here again. So, yeah, it was just getting too much to be a mess. I couldn't find anything. I had to put some steel away. And uh, now it's clean again for until we get this next panel built. When I get more, uh, it'll be tomorrow, and uh, we'll pick it up then. Have a nice evening. 
Later.